The oldest son of the current king of Malaysia, Crown Prince Tunku Ismail Idris, and his wife are such a beautiful royal couple with four kids. His wife, Khalida Bustamam, was a commoner, but after her wedding to the Crown Prince, she became the Malaysian princess of people's hearts. People love her so much for her beauty and good deeds. But like many famous people, she once encountered scammers, and she had to contact the police after she saw something on the internet. Keep watching the WOW channel to discover the heartbreaking story of the future Queen of Malaysia. Malaysia has a unique rotational monarchy. Nine royal families rule over different states. Every five years, one is chosen from among the sultans of the states to rule the entire country. Today we will talk about the royal family of Johor. Recently, Sultan Ibrahim Iskandar of Johor became the new king of Malaysia. He is one of the most influential and wealthiest sultans in the country. His family has a fortune of 5.7 billion dollars and its own army. The Sultan's oldest son, Crown Prince Tunku Ismail Idris, fondly known as TMJ, is his primary heir. If elected to this post, he will be the future ruler of Johor and likely the future king of Malaysia. This means that his wife, Khalida Bustamam, the future queen of Johor, will likely become the queen of Malaysia. Her Highness is actively involved in the country's social life and often appears publicly. Therefore, we can assume that this woman is very ambitious and aspires to occupy a high position in the future. She has already won the affection of many Malaysians and is referred to in the press as the People's Princess for her good deeds and rare beauty. As far as we know, the princess doesn't have royal roots. Her official biography states that she was born in Kuala Lumpur and was the fifth child of Bustamam bin Daud and Asia bin Abdul Aziz. Apparently, they did not have any special titles in Malaysia, but were respected and wealthy people in their country. When Khalida binti Bustamam was a teenager, her mother served as the Malaysian High Commissioner in the United Kingdom. The girl had to move to England with her mother. There, the future princess received a good education. While in England, she attended St. George's School at Hanover Square before enrolling at Westminster Academy in London in 2004. In 2009, she returned to Malaysia and studied at the Shrai Utama School in Kuala Lumpur, graduating in 2010. Today, Khalida Bustamam is fluent in three languages – Malay, English and Spanish. Even though she was born a commoner, she is so well-educated and beautiful that she is the perfect match for the prince. Her Highness Khalida Bustamam is very tall and stands out among all the royalty in Malaysia. Unsurprisingly, Crown Prince Tunku Ismail Idris fell in love with her at first sight. During an interview with a local TV channel, Crown Prince TMJ said they met at a polo game. On the first day, Khalida did not know she had met the real prince and thought he was just one of the players. Apparently, the prince wanted to impress her simply with his charm and would not reveal his high status ahead of time. Well, he succeeded. Soon the couple announced their upcoming wedding. The royal family happily approved the prince's choice and accepted Khalida into their circle. We clicked and I can talk to her. We share the same passion and she loves football, which I am also passionate about. Prince shared in an official statement before the wedding. Their touching wedding ceremony took place in 2014 at Istana Bukit Serene. It was a beautiful traditional Malay ceremony. The bride glowed with happiness in a white dress. The groom was dressed in traditional Malaysian clothing and wore a military uniform. About 2,000 guests attended the ceremony. Upon her marriage, Khalida Bustamam received the prestigious title of the Che Puan, equivalent to the English lady, as a crown prince's consort that was of non-royal blood.
Their first child was born two years after their wedding. It was a girl. The family was happy, but of course everyone expected that the newly made princess would give birth to a boy heir, and soon she succeeded. Another year later, she gave birth to her first son. This family has four children today, two girls and two boys. Apparently, this is a very happy marriage, as the Crown Prince of Johor has often said that his wife is a very supportive partner. Here are the most beautiful sayings of the prince. A woman who loves you will support you in every single thing you do, regardless of the situation. She will always be there for you, not making demands or trying to dictate your life. Motherhood is a hard job, but Her Highness Khalida Bustama managed not only to be a mother, but also to take part in many important state events as a dedicated member of Johor Royal. She often accompanies her mother-in-law, Queen Raja Zarith Safiya. In 2021, Khalida Bustamam was named as the Pro-Chancellor of the University of Technology Malaysia. She is also the President of the Malaysian Girl Guides Association for the Johor State Branch. Khalida Bustamam has earned the unofficial title of People's Princess because she has won the hearts of many people in Malaysia. She often draws attention to social issues, such as the unacceptability of child abuse. Children are a country's biggest asset and they need to be protected from anything that could endanger their safety and welfare. There is no excuse for people to physically or mentally abuse children. This matter needs to be combated through every method available in accordance with the rule of law, she wrote on her social media account. Khalida Bustamam also actively advocated for a ceasefire in the Gaza Strip following the Palestine issue. Moreover, the princess demonstrates impeccable style and elegance in her clothes. She usually prefers traditional Malaysian clothing, but sometimes appears in modern, modest outfits at informal events. However, the life of a princess is not only about wealth and success in all matters. It is also about difficulties that she sometimes has to face. One day an incident occurred in the Malaysian royal family, after which Khalida Bustamam had to go to the police. A terrible incident happened in the summer of 2023. Unknown scammers created a fake page on Facebook in the name of Khalida Bustamam and advertised a Japanese air conditioner on this page. Using a photo editor, the deceivers created a fake image of the Malaysian princess holding an air conditioner. One of the fake photographs shows the princess, her husband, and her children with an air conditioner next to them. In this way, they tried to attract attention to their product, to sell it and make a profit. This outrageous incident could negatively impact the royal family's reputation. Of course, the police took up this matter. The case was initiated under an article of fraud. Scammers faced a punishment of up to seven years in prison. Agree, it's awful when scammers try to make money by someone else's name. We hope they were punished. I want to remind you that the future Queen of Johor has only one official Facebook page, where she posts information about her family, official events program and holiday greetings. This page is called Yam Che Puan Bisar Kalida. She also has an official Instagram account with almost a million followers and recently received the high royal status of Che Puan Makota, as announced officially by the royal court. This is how the former commoner won people's hearts and became a respected lady in her country. Her story is very inspiring, don't you think so? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to write comments, like and subscribe to the channel. See you next time.